there's a great deal of uh, energy and water that is involved with the whole supply chain to be able to get this into our hands where we want it. We use approximately 18 million barrels of oil to transport water, and it's growing every year. When you think of the total impact that that has, it is um, a very expensive way to provide the delivery of water, and often with questionable quality in the first place. Where does uh, Fiji water come from? Fiji water comes from Fiji, I think. I don't know. In a time when we're looking at climate change, why are we shipping water around the world um, from another country when we have good tap water to drink? It takes a lot of oil to make the bottles themselves. It takes 17 million barrels of oil to make the bottles just used in the United States each year. And then it takes even more oil to transport the water to um, bottling plants to get bottled and then to distribution centers and across the country. It takes oil to chill the bottles and it takes oil to dispose of the bottles, to collect them and dispose of them in, at recycling plants or in dumps or incinerators. In fact, the total amount of energy required for every bottle of water is equivalent on average to filling a plastic bottle a quarter of the way full with oil. When we make plastic bottles, the 50 billion bottles or so that we use each year, it generates two and a half tons of carbon dioxide. 